was with last night. So. Her? <laughs> okay, we are here in my base, no? Okay, so just give me, give, give me, give me a sec oh. to. Oof. You good night. Uh, yeah, that's think, all right. I think, you, I think you hit him at just the right spot, Duelist. <laughs> yeah. Shutting down. Sensors offline. Weapons offline. Reaction offline. Oh boy. That's another set of uh, drivers, by the way. I'm trying. Me. Well, now that you, now that, now that you're almost with SJ, get the SJ New Egg promo code discount. <laughs> That'd be awesome. Yes, it's uh, SJ underscore no soup for you. SJ underscore. Sensors online. Weapons online. All right, I'll take the liberty moving the uh, mech to the base mech. Maybe even get it on top of the head. Wait, what? What are you doing? Good what job. are we doing? There's a there's a protocol to this. I've seen this done before. Okay, so this is what's gonna happen once. <laughs> what was that read? A nod of approval. <laughs> once once Bayard's back in. And in his mech, uh, both pace mechs will bring bring them to an area near center. And then, once the pace mechs break off and say go, the match will begin, and then you guys will blow each other up. Oh, okay. I just had an cool. idea. Dude, May, ha, Red and Yard can go radar inactive, so that we can actually put them in a spot where they don't see each other on radar and visually. Well, but Vic. they'll still be within, like, say, I don't know, 800 meters or whatever? Vic, this is what I'm thinking. As the pace mech, you can select a spot that you feel is fair to, for Bayard to be able to see your guys' mech and for your guys' mech to see the other guys' mech, uh, but not necessarily for them to disclose where they're at. Uh, but since we're putting them close enough to each other, and since they probably just want to ram in the center anyway and blow each other up, um, we can bring them in, you can bring them in somewhere into the D or the E line, and I'll bring my guy somewhere into the E and the F line. And then, then that way they're close enough to each other, and then the understanding will be that the battle arena is the three, um, the three satellite dishes at center. And so you can circle around that, you can set up anywhere you want in there once you do, but don't go out of there, and then that way, you, uh, Red can still use his range, and, and Bayard can use his range, that kind of stuff. Oh yeah, speaking of range, uh, Red, that mech that you're in has got close range weapons. It's a uh, heavy goss, is it not? So I improved one. Oh, improved heavy goss. Uh. Well, it still does incredible amounts of damage up close. Yeah. Yeah, but the problem is not me, the problem is what he, what he has. I can use range to hit him hard before he, he get into my range. But if we start back to back, I'm already... We won't be starting back to back. Nick and I are going to put you guys in a position that it uh, won't take you guys forever to find each other, but also that you guys will uh, mm. have some element of surprise or you uh, etc reactor online sensors online weapons online all systems known okay Vic start moving your your guy um Bayard follow the MK2 right Again, Vic, I'm looking somewhere in the D line or E line for your guy, and then we'll set up somewhere in the um, F G line, uh, somewhere around the satellite dishes. But yeah, we should uh, change it so that we can put the links of the streaming people. Yeah, I'll take care of that. There. 
because when we're streaming, we don't want to exit the program to tell people what our stream link is. It scrubs the uh, streaming. Jesus Christ, this mech has got a lot of electronics on it. Okay, Bayard, this will be your position. Uh, once I move out of your way, uh, you'll be able to begin the match. Alright. Vic, let me know when your guy's in position. Red, if you start from this position, I think it's good for you. Okay, guys, the battle arena is the satellite dishes and the passes around them. Try not to go outside of that area. Okay? Okay. okay. Vic, your guy ready? Yes. Okay. Yes. okay. As, soon as, as soon as Vic and I move out of you guys' line of sight, the match will begin and Vic and I will despawn. Alright. Okay, match has begun for my guy. Okay, so, ready. Ready, ready. Ping on me, I don't know if this Meg is uh, Dwellish, your Meg is here. I'm in an M I was an MK2. I don't know which Meg is, but I have something here in my sign. There's also a Solitaire out there, ignore the Solitaire. Okay. Channel switched. User was uh -huh. moved to yeah. your channel. Alright, it's oh, underway. Alright, sounds good. Yeah, w we have them only, um, yeah, those are the main uh parts of uh christian uh christian christian -y? yeah so yeah and and then the, the other smaller parts were just in bigger cities uh not not in smaller very very well as well, they on on the smaller villages and so only on bigger cities I ask you this you don't you don't have counties you have villages right uh, counties? Uh, no. Uh, it, yeah. I it, believe it, they it, have provinces as well. Yeah, provinces uh, we, we do have, yeah. So it's like, uh, uh, Bavarian, yeah, is a province. So instead of county, you say province? Uh, yeah, now nah, it, it's more like in state. Yeah, but yeah, your states were so big like uh, Germany, but, uh, yeah. We have For contact. You, it would be a, a kind of county. Oh yeah, go on. <laughs> oh, fighting hard. Bayard's gonna have to try to time those Gauss hits and uh, let him hit his arms. Well, see what Red should have done was immediately try to take off that large pulse laser arm. Because it's gonna be doing the most damage. Bye bye engine. Well, they must both be pretty hurt because they're both trying to avoid their noses being shot off right now. It is amazing how small the die she looks compared to the Fafnir. Being as far as. We have it. Alright. 